Right, Eagle of Moss. What do we do with this? Hi guys, Retro Trek Ralph here. Eagle Moss, Enterprise D build. It's, there's been a few people out there doing their um, little thing and I'm <clears throat> yeah let's just say I'm a little annoyed it, it, it's it's not unprecedented that a build series like this would fail it's also a little bit annoying that it has failed when we've seen so much stuff from them that we were promised it, it's been months since my last delivery my last one was magazine 20 issue was up to 78 parts so yeah I've, I've had Eagle Master's customer services on some level were absolutely brilliant they've um, gone in admin obviously or requested administration the intention of appointing an administrator shall we say officially um yeah the, the, the part what gets me is that the ship was built but they have extra parts so they were never really bothered about um yeah, the, the amount. Here we go. We've got three windows on this this model. Here's three pieces of plastic. But then when there was something wrong, you can get in touch with them, and you could get a full issue kit. I just want that. Want another one of them? Yeah, we'll send you the entire part kit. Okay, fine. Thanks. So they're really good at that. And Zoe, I think it was on on Facebook. You could ask her anything. It was absolutely brilliant. She'd get through to everything. <sighs> but as you can tell, in my voice. I'm a little bit annoyed. The ship has got to this stage. I mean, yeah, there's gaps. We know there's problems. We know there's whatevers. And uh, Dan's mixtape just did a video not long since, probably last week, I think it was, of I got it right. I don't like being right or uh, as like this, shall we say. It's, it's annoying. It's frustrating. It shouldn't, this shouldn't have happened. Somewhere along the lines, there are the full pieces for this. I mean, we have some sections that are amazingly done. I mean, dance mix tape again took, with the, the gap of a couple of months, took all these pieces to, uh, uh, apart, took the, the dark parts of the windows, painted them or resined them, or I think some of the people, uh, Wayne, the world of Wayne. Yeah, the lighting on that is shockingly diabolical. Can you see any light? There's a, there's a certain subtlety, but why the hell is there a spotlight on front? That's a torpedo launcher. So there was problems with it. But there are certain flashes that looks to me blue more than green. But yeah, it, it, but then this silly gap on here. What the hell is that? It's it's annoyance. It's it's yeah. I was actually thinking, seeing as these have gone, these have officially gone under. So you, all your websites that you go to for Edel Moss for buying the smaller stuff, which I've been collecting for over ten years now, it's. It, 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 I think you can probably hear the frustration in my voice. That's yes, they've gone under. Yes, people are going. Oh, it's so sad that they're going under, and oh, I feel sorry for all their um, other people working for them. There's some really good bits on these. I mean, that doesn't fit properly, as we know. But I've had problems with Eagle Moss for a long, long time. There was the problems with the Discovery collection. That was hit and miss. So luckily that came to a finish and done with 32, was it? Issues gone. Which was kind of nice, then it, f it finished, but then there was also a couple more series left to go, so why end it there? But, also at the same time, there were, all, there were massive, massive problems. Well, that just describes everything. Okay, uh, but there was massive problems. Actually, I just noticed on here that this part on here was built wrong. Yeah, it kind of looks like it's melted. It sounds like it's actually melted, but it's kind of like the mould. The rush through it should have followed this line here. It's not impossible to do. You could probably take the panel out, which just unscrews in like this side here. Fill in all the holes, cut in your own ones anyway. But that's that's not for this just yet. So this is annoying. I'm trying to do a straight 
two piece camera um, part for this without getting too annoyed. But that looks pretty. That looks quite good. So it's almost got the parts on with no chassis and no shell. The shell's there. Yeah, I think, I know Eagle Moss knew they had problems. It was obvious from years ago. And we look back on their um, actual bits that they were, yeah, the sales, shall we say, and it wasn't as productive as what they hoped. It would have been nicer if they'd have been completely honest with us and said, look, you know, we're gonna take a little break from this and we're just gonna, we're not going to do certain things. Actually, we've got right to the front as well, don't we? <sighs> we're gonna take a break. We have to sort something out. We will be back, promise you. And that would, we would have believed. It would be fine. But instead, I think they, I'm, I'm positive they knew this was coming. And it's, it's annoying, yes. Is it unprecedented? No. Is it chew me up? Yes. But it's also, yeah, there's nothing much we can do about it. I mean, there's also, this is what gets me, from the, right from the beginning, there was, we never actually got fitted. I never also got the screw box as well, which is a little bit silly. So they'd obviously got massive problems with parts and bits and distribution and were never really bothered about, sorry, but we need part kits. That's why I got these bits for parts and screws. But it's also, I don't want to keep going on about it, but I'm, I'm positive they knew what they were doing. By the way, this is a, a, when you ask them for parts, they will give you extras because they're nice. I mean, I could continue with bits from eBay, shall we say, to possibly do the edging on here. I mean, somebody did actually do it on Facebook the other day, a picture going complete, and they just basically put it on the grass and just, it looks like the Enterprise D from Generations and it crash landed just the saucer section. Brilliant, funny, really do, yes. And it's, the light at the end of the tunnel was, we know they've gone into administration, somebody has been in touch with the Chinese manufacturers of this and says, well, what is happening? What exactly have you got? And they've got all the prints. I don't think they've got all the stock. If they had, then please, somebody sort something out so we can get this finished. It would be amazing if we could. I mean, it'd be, it'd be more than amazing if we could get this finished. But it, it's just, what? there's nothing we can do. As fans, yes, we are kind of in control over most of this. And that's why when we brought Star Trek back, it was all the fans who did what the fans do. They brought it back from being cancelled. We know the prints for the parts are out there. This is up to 78 out of 120. We know there's a possibility that this could get completed. And like I said the manufacturers are waiting on what to do next. And hopefully somebody out there, whether or not it's it's a different branch of Eagle Moss, whether or not it's Diagosti, whether or not it's, it's another part build company will take this on because we are all desperate to get this finished. We know it's got its faults. We know it's got little things which aren't right, but we want to make this right. We want the pieces to get this completed, I mean, the months that were the gap between the last delivery and now would have been perfect. Strip all this lot down, take the windows out, resin up to the windows, sealing everything, screw everything together, because there's too much part work underneath here, pushing the parts apart, basically. Could easily be done a different way, a bit more time and effort just to screw all these bit in. The paintwork is, it, it, it's, it's brilliant actual paintwork some bits couldn't understand why they're there but a lot of it just wants somebody to come along and help us and if the manufacturers in china have got everything somebody out there please 
get in touch with them, get this carrying on, get this completed, please. Honestly, please. The time of re recording this, which is the 24th of July, I'll release this tomorrow, uh, yeah, or at midnight or whatever, or as soon as I can get this into the office to do an edit or whatever with. Uh, there are people who have got the, the, the I'm not sure if it's if it's just more Edel Moss. I want to keep this as clean as possible on the wording, but it just seems like some people are getting messages. Your deliveries will be on the way. Are they? They're not doing anything. The website's gone. Facebook's gone. They're not speaking to anybody. They're not replying to anything. It, it's just suddenly stopped. But if people are starting to get deliveries, maybe this is just a hiccup. I paid three month subscription per gubbins on this. I got one part kit from that three months. So it is a little bit owing me. But at the same time, if it's a case, we just need to hold back, wait and see what happens with all this. So be it. I've been waiting nearly three months. So what's going on, Eagle Boss? Tell us or give us who the administrator is and then let's just see what we can do. Because the only thing I can think of doing is, I know I can't get parts of people off eBay to get this fully completed. That part, I've only seen that once. There's an American who did a YouTube live stream a few days ago, maybe a week or so ago, and he has got that part. We've got nothing from the underside, absolutely zero. I don't care if it's kind of, you can get this part, the underside part, all these panels or whatever, or something made that we could potentially, you can definitely get another one of these, definitely get another one of these, because that is completed, that will fit on there, either side, just click in place. We can finish the nacelle by parts we can scrimp and whatever off eBay. But at the minute, it's going to be a lot of people, if there is a possibility of it, it's going to be a lot of people fighting over very few pieces. But once Eagle Moss, if they do go into administration, there'll be parts, there'll be bits, there'll be all sorts. But there are so many individual bits left to do on this that you couldn't scrimp and save. Maybe that panel there could go underneath. That panel but over here could go underneath. You've got the bit where the, the captain's yacht is underneath this section, which will be completely only that bit. I guarantee you there are some bits of these that will be a copy on the other side. Or at least it could be copied on the other side. Yeah, but like I said before, well, we're just going off on a tangent again, is it would have been amazing to go, I'll get all the lifeboats, all these new stickers on, I'll get all the windows took out and then resin put in, paint behind them, light block everything behind them for the two, three months between the last delivery and now, would have been perfect. And there are people, like I said, people out there who have done that, Wayne, uh, Willa Wayne, Dan the Mixtape, the, 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 countless others who stopped doing the Red Little Build, which I didn't. I just thought it would be a good thing to do at a later date. See what Eagle Moss come out with. And now we know. So, with that in mind, um, yeah, the people who have got the parts for this, the, the Chinese company, I don't know who you are, please help the fans out. Help the fans out and let's get this, this sorted out. There's, there's more than just the Enterprise D build as well. There's the Ghostbusters, there's the, the Ecto, the, the, the DeLorean, the, the countless others that, that Eagle Moss were doing and then just stopped. But like I said from the start, I know Edel Moss have got problems, but they didn't tell us the full extent of this because, because what? Because we wouldn't know the truth? Because we wouldn't figure this thing out? I mean, yes, tell us you've got issues. We may be able to help out. Don't know. Would it be nice with a little bit of truth from the beginning? So with that in mind, yeah, a little bit annoyed, but this for the time being, until we know anything else, is the last Enterprise D build box series thing, shall we say. So no idea what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna leave it to you guys and see what happens. So thanks for watching. Please like, share, subscribe. Please follow me on social media. I have other videos. This isn't the end of the channel. This is just the end of this build series and until somebody comes along with a good idea. Uh, so yeah. Like, share, subscribe, follow me on social media, um, message below, please comment, please 
do somebody with something. I am not in the position to even consider doing any sort of work on getting this this build series completed let's just hope somebody out there will do this for us and we can all benefit so yeah let, let's let's leave it there so thanks for watching bye for now